let's see how to add transparent blocks to Minecraft. All right, we find ourselves back in IntelliJ once more. And in this tutorial, we're going to be adding a transparent block to Minecraft. So basically sort of custom glass adjacent. And this is going to be done, of course, in the, the mod blocks class, we're going to add a new block. So let's just copy over, let's say the pink rose right here. And we're going to make this the winter underscore window. And of course, the same with a name winter underscore window. Now, what's very important here is that we actually want to make this a glass block. Now, the reason for this is first of all, of course, sure that we only have the block behavior properties right here. And then what we can take a look at inside of the glass block, if we middle mouse button click on this, and then middle mouse button click on the abstract glass block here, you can see that first of all, we get a few methods that are overridden, mainly propagates skylight down and the shade brightness. So those overridden methods are essential to get the full transparent effect for an entirely transparent block. This is why I usually then say, well, let's just overwrite the glass block. And then let's, of course, also just copy the glass block properties here. And then we should pretty much be fine with the registration. The interesting thing then happens in the tutorial mod class, because here, which we've already seen basically with the render layer for the both the ebony door and the ebony trap door, where we had this translucent well part of the door, we basically want to do the same thing for the winter window, where we also want to set the render layer to translucent, so that we can basically see through the actual window. That's the general idea. Then all of the other stuff. So for example, the translation here that we're just going to do immediately because otherwise I might forget this and we don't want that to happen. So let's just say winter underscore window. And then of course, right here as well, winter window, not winter window rose, though, that would not be correct. There you go winter window. And then the well, the all of the JSON files are pretty much standard. So let's just see the winter window here, the block states JSON file just points to a normal block model as well. So this is pretty much standard. Let's see the block model. The block model is just cube all and the item model pretty much the same thing just points back to the block model JSON file. There you go. So all fairly straightforward. Let's also copy over the texture all of the JSON files as well as the code is of course also available to you in the description below GitHub repository in individual gists as well. But that is actually all that we need to do. The main thing really is that you want to make this a glass block if it's an entire block that is transparent. And you will need to also call the render layer right here in the client setup method. That is two things that we need. So after all of this has been added, let's see if it works. All right, we found ourselves back in Minecraft. And as you can see, the winter window has been successfully added to the game and it is transparent, just like we would imagine it to. So we can take a look at this and we can see through it just like well, any other type of glass, basically. And yeah, that's actually how easy it can be to add a transparent block to Minecraft. Right, and that is already it for this tutorial right here. I hope you found this useful and you learned something new. If you did, I would very much appreciate a like. And don't forget to subscribe for more tutorials just like this one. I also want to thank all of my lovely Patreon supporters for supporting me and this channel. It is very much appreciated. And special golden thanks go out to MC Arctic for actually supporting me with the gold block tier. And I'll see you in the next tutorial. So, yeah.